What's going on? She's just, she's, she's about to give birth. So she, the puppies have to stay inside the no, house with the mommy yeah. no, when, okay. when she has them to, to nurse. Okay. You I, have well, to have the well, puppy I make for sure, about. I make, she, I make sure she do that. You have, when they start getting a certain size. As soon as they're six, eight weeks, we can take the puppies. Okay, y'all got them in? And then we got to get her spayed so she doesn't get pregnant again. I'm telling you, because she just oh, okay. loose, loose, loose. Does she get out a lot? See, Does she live outside? Yeah, well, yeah. We, I try to keep her in the back, but put him in the front, but it just... So she's not allowed in the house? Uh, we, I usually put him on the back. I got a back, back there with my washing machine to dry him. And I put them inside the, um, it's the clothes in. But it's not air conditioned, right? Babies. It's not air conditioned? No, it's just part of the house. It's okay. Just, How old is she? I had her when she was, um, that's my sister's dog, so she couldn't keep it. And she asked me the, the place she was living. What's her name? Um, Zena. Hi, Zena. Is she friendly? Mm -hmm. Hi. Okay. What? I get um, okay, good. Yeah, please okay. call us so we can get we can get them, you know, get the puppies taken care of and get her spayed so she doesn't okay, have she any. Okay, she have another card? Yeah, I'll get you another card right now. How old is he? Maybe, maybe a year. A year? Okay, he's not a year yet. Not even no, a year. Benji, okay. you're all right. You're okay. You're okay. He has to. He has to fit in there. It's okay. temporary. It's short. Come on, buddy. Oh, good boy. Oh, pumpkin. Get it lift up. Yeah, this lifts. Yeah, I know. I just don't want him to choke himself. Okay. Let me take this off. Take it off. Yeah. Oh, he's a good boy. I see Stay. Stay. We have more chicken chess. I'll put Get him in. Close this. He's fine. He's fine. You can do it from the back because I don't want to take any chances of this dog. So guys, we're here driving around Liberty City, Miami. Um, we've got some calls about a dog and we're pulling up on the street and there's a dog on the street just roaming the road. Dogs everywhere. And started feeding chicken to the dog and uh, saw some people pull up and asked if we knew who the dog belonged to and they said yes them <laughs> um, the dog Church. basically lives outside as you heard the people talking and um, he's not even a year of age oh, dirty he lives outside he's lived out he's not even he's a babe not even a year old his name is King and the other dog that was on the property in the front yard she lives outside she's a female and she's pregnant by King by King. Yeah. That's the daddy, and that's what we have going on here. Just Thanks. ignorance and ignorance. Hi, King. I so, think that's the daddy, and that's the, the um, son of the pregnant I was dog. I going to say, it might be the daddy and the baby. You can't. It's probably because all she's like, babies, where, too. Where, where, where are they taking your baby? That's what she kept oh, saying. I'm like, oh, Jesus. Yes. Okay. We need donations, guys, uh, because we've got oh, King. No. We have Benji now in the back, Benji. in the crate. It's going to be a stressful ride home. We cannot pick up any more dogs no. because this is all we have. We have no room. Oh, and there goes Benji crying. All right, we're going to put on some soundscape music, and we're going to head home, head back to the animal hospital, get these babies safe. Please, we're in Liberty City. This place is like hell on earth. 
This is not a good neighborhood. Trust me when I There's tell cops you. There's cops trouble. everywhere. There, it's just, it's, uh, I can't even put it into words. If any of you have not ever visited Liberty City, Miami, do not. Do not. Yeah, not by yourself. Yeah. Not by yourself, yeah. that's for sure. You okay, King? The ladies that are the lady who's looking for um the non allergenic and dog and things like that, I sent her a picture of um Benji, Benji in the back. Good. And she just texts me she wants I mean wants, wants to, meet? to know a little bit. We don't know anything dog, yet. Well, that's so what I'm gonna have to tell her. So as you can see we're driving we're driving down the street here and um cops right here. There they got two police officers. It's just disgusting. There's dogs in backyards that are tied up, filthy, dirty, living in complete trash. He's gone. The dog's gone. Right. There was a dog there that we actually stopped the police officers asking about the dog because it looked half dead, laying on the front stoop. Um, we didn't know if the house was abandoned. <laughs> Sorry, I can't answer the phone right now while I'm driving. Can you put navigation to get us out of here, Tam? No, Please. I know, right? The nerves. <laughs> this is when our nerves are like all over the place because it's, it's very stressful. Very stressful being here. That's all I can tell you. Are you sniffing me? Maybe you like the crappy toilet. <laughs> I think I'm going to turn right just for that. No, I'm going to wait for you. Take us back yeah, to IP. Take, uh, Take your time. Take your time. So again, um, I'm here in the car. Um, this is Amy. I'm driving. I've got Tammy in the passenger, and I have uh, Jesse and Kathy in the back seat. Um, people calling, people calling nonstop. The phone has not stopped. So um, we were called out. Actually, asked to help. Turn right. Turn left on the Northwest 15th Avenue. I don't know where 15th Avenue is. Point three miles. Okay. Um, we were called out to ask a dog, ask, a ask for help, um, of a dog. You see what I live with? It's just non-stop. I can't breathe for a second. Sorry. Yeah. We were called out for, to help a dog earlier this morning, got here. The dog was not here. We were told they were feeding the dog every day. The family moved out. A big, big, big black dog. Um, fluffy, big, I don't know, chow retriever or something like that. And uh, we came out, no dog. Drove around. Then we got tagged in a post um, of another dog that we actually went out to Little Haiti. And we got that dog. That's Benji. Benji, uh, his owners moved out, or she moved out. Um, the neighbor was taking care of the dog, feeding and watering. And um, he was outside for four months. Four months. That looks really familiar. He was outside for four months, and um, I'm gonna turn left here. Sorry, I'm trying to drive at the same time. Um, so, anyways, we got Benji. He's in the back, back of my SUV in a crate, and we had to move him. He lost his spot on Jesse and Kathy's lap because we went to Liberty City, and as we were driving around the neighborhood. Yeah. Um, this dog was out on the street right here. This is King. I'm at a red light and um, looks skinny, dirty, and he's so sweet. He's not even a year of age. Well, the people that were getting out of their car, we decided to ask them if they knew who the dog belonged to while Jesse was feeding chicken to him on this curb um, in the middle of this horrific neighborhood. And um, they said, yes, it was their dog. And then five seconds later, um, that short-lived yay was gone because they said take him so um, That's exactly what we did and you heard the conversation after we started talking to the owner of, do of the dog king uh, She now tells us she has a female that's ready to pop with puppies that lives outside King lived in the back and she lives in the front and He's the daddy they believe but they're not sure because um, and you know, they don't know. The dogs get out out of the yard all the time. So that's what we have. I'm driving, I'm gonna sign off because it is not safe to video and drive and talk at the same time. Um, so we are on our way back to the animal hospital and we desperately need donations. So please call in to the hospital if you want to, 954-771-0156 or you can donate directly through the PayPal link on our page. Uh, and please consider fostering adopting. We have two more lives saved in our cars right now. We're heading back. 
This is Amy 100 Plus, Abandoned Dogs of Everglades, Florida.